Okay, now let's place our reference image first on this so we can draw over top of it. Make sure that your reference image is in the correct folder. You know, here's our fish one folder we made, it's in the resources. So, again, whenever you save this at the end of the semester, save the entire folder and all this stuff is all together. Okie doke. Here we are at our uh, AI file here. Click File place, um, navigate to the where your uh, reference photo is, choose it, click the word place, and you'll get this loaded cursor. You can just hover anywhere over your canvas here and click it, and there it is. Um, set it, it doesn't have to be perfect, uh, set it somewhere in the center. Hold, uh, hover over a corner, hold down the shift key, and hold down the option key or alt key on the PC. Click, hold, and drag. By holding down option or alt um, key, it, it keeps it centered like this. Okay. You can hold down the shift key and do one of these deals, you know, do, do it side by side. But holding down the option or alt key makes it easier. So just so it's kind of sort of in the middle there. And um, let's see, what else we want to do here? Um, make it nice and big. OK, so like make it fill you know, from side to side. With it still selected, go up top here, and you'll see an opacity um, setting. Hit the drop down menu, and it's move the slider to, oh, let's go to about 50%, um, just like dimming it a little bit so that it'll be like easier to draw over. You can even go a little bit lower. I'm going to go like to 45 or so. Okay, um, that's what I got to do. Now open the layers palette on the right side and it's going to say layer one. This is a fairly simple project, but get into the habit of, of labeling your layers. So I'll click on that there, and I'll call this image. You can call it reference, whatever, but call it something, um, photo, whatever. Okay, so now what I want you to do is we're going to lock down this layer so it's easier to draw over it. If you don't lock it down, your life is miserable. So um, here's the eyeball turns on the visibility and turns off the visibility. Right next to it is this blank space. If you hover over it, it'll say to toggles lock. Click on that and a little little lock uh, icon will appear. So now this, if you hover over it, you can't do anything. You get this little weird little symbol. Um, all right, make, uh, I think we'll stop the video right there. Um, okay, I'll see you in the next video.